Hello everyone, welcome to Achieve Asada. Guys, for the first time, I'm going to share my journey of the JRF, how I went through with my preparation journey and how I went through with a JRF examination. Everything in detail, I'm going to share it with you guys without any modifications, deletions, additions, nothing. Just I'm going to tell you the reality how I went through. What were my problems being an aspirant? How I uh, prepared uh, as a self? So all these things I'm going to tell you. And for the first timers, myself, Vodnala Shivlingam, a qualified net jar in commerce. I'm a verified educator at an academy platform for teaching to the UGC net paper one as well as paper two commerce in the English medium of instruction since the past three years. So here guys, uh, if I can start my journey of the JRF, that was of a time period 2018 December where NTA started conducting the exam of the UGC net. That was my first attempt which I qualified for the UGC net only. Later in the June 2019, I, uh, 2019, I qualified for the JRF. Now before the 2018 December, there are some things which I just wanted to share it with you before my preparation journey. So I was being a CS student, Chartered Accountancy course, CIPCC Intermediate. So in that the same subjects of UGC net paper to you used to be there, but I don't know about this exam. By the time December 2018 before, uh, after completing my PG, I entered into a competitive examination to get the government job. I give only, I used to give only commerce related government job because I don't know the general subjects much. I am not much into the general subject. So there were recruitment, there were four electricity companies recruitment was happened in the 2018 and uh, prior to that. So I was participating in that. I used to get a good score, but I didn't went through with the recruitment due to that cutoff and high and all. So various issues were involved in it. That's okay. I didn't went through. Now I'm blank. What about my career? Because I sat for those competitive examination by leaving my job at that time, financially not sound and uh, not much support was there. So anything we have, I have to do, uh, is there any other career opportunities or the exams which I can give it, where I can settle down with the same knowledge. When I was searching for that, one of my friend who qualified for the UG Senate has recommended that Are, you can give this UG Senate exam. And if you qualify in the JRF now, you will get a 30,000 per month you are going to get. At the time, I think 28,000 something was there. You will get this month and you can join into the PhD. You can go into the teaching career like that. So before that itself, we used to have a YouTube channel. This YouTube channel in the name of JO online classes, it used to be there. That was my old videos where I used to struggle to teach. So just to share something I used to teach. That was a very bad videos, which you can see now also in the, in the channel, it is there. 2015 only this channel was there, but that was for competitive examination. And uh, uh, once the friend is recommended, Chalo, I prepared this much for the competitive examination. For the uncertainty, I prepared this much. Now he's saying same subject. Now let us give this exam. I applied for it uh, before the 45 days of December 2018. Exam, I started my preparation towards the December 2018. I prepared only PYQs. He used to guide. Are this is important. This is important. You prepare for this. You prepare for this. Like that he used to suggest. Initial stage. Because I don't know the examination pattern. Whatever the common subjects that were there in the CA, na, I ignored that part. Remaining subjects which were not there in the CA IPCC, like a financial management, ignored. Accounting, no need, because uh, in management, accounting, auditing, all these were ignored. Only uh, law also. Law also we studied much extent in the CA IPCC. So which were not there in the CA, like a business management, banking, as well as a, uh, the part which uh, is business environment, international business. These I used to study in the internet and all so mainly pyqs were concentrated more i bought one book called as an rl gupta initially december 2018 itself rl gupta i bought it he suggested i, I bought that book so once i bought that i used to went through with that uh, pyqs and some questions will be having explanation some questions was not having explanation which were not having i used to search in the google and make a note of those things that was a just a raw preparation not much uh, intensive preparation in the december 2018 so somehow managed to give the exam and given the exam not expecting anything because i am mentally fixed i should prepare a long term basis for the next attempt for the net and jrf this time is a practice for me like that i thought so once i sat uh, for the exam i given the exam but uh, i was not having any idea whether I will get through or not. 
it was a blur mode of exam only not much confidence and all so once the result came out within very short period of 15 to 20 days only result they given once the result came out i qualified for the ug senet that was a surprise biggest surprise for me or i was preparing for something which i have uh, didn't even get in the one examination of competitive i didn't got any job now with a minimum effort i got this one that was a luck factor also involved in that uh, december 2018 then i thought chalo let us now prepare in a strategic way for the long term now at any cost i should get a jrf because financially i don't want to compromise at to the at the time financial struggle was there nobody was supporting in inside home as my father was not there and uh, mother is the only one who is taking care so that uh, that's how the situation i used to understand I, i have to understand entire situation and need to move on so at any case i have to take the uh, chance uh, and when i was uh, working in the private company i used to get that amount no? now i am i am not getting that also because due to the competitive examination i resigned that one later once i sat for the exam uh, uh, sat for the preparation for the long term june 2019 attempt there i started my actual real preparation in the january and our february first week we started me and my friend started he used to guide me again and again are you qualified no now you go in this way this is the book uh, rl gupta is a good book for the pyq and paper 1 paper 2 you can get a uh, overview from this and these websites uh, you can visit like government website used to be there he used to suggest the pdf of uh, igno material and all in this uh, very vast explanations will be there and uh, each and every topic you can cover because the topics which we know that is business finance financial management income tax uh, we are having a strong uh, base for that no need to prepare that much intensively but other subjects went through with the intensive preparation like uh, in depth preparation we haven't done but overview of uh, each and every unit i used to get it later while solving a pyqs either i used to have one friend called as a vinay one friend called as a ramesh we three were into preparation at that time initially initially the throughout the june 2019 this is the three people uh, group so when a pyqs if i wanted to solve for a one unit i used to call to any one of this fellow i we both will discuss the pyqs in the call only for a one hour two hour till our concentration uh, losing we used to discuss whenever we lose our concentration and interest now we will cut the call and we'll go into the sleep or somehow preparing for other unit so like that we used to put a target for a, every 3 days we need to complete a one um, subject pyqs of 2019 uh, and before so 2018 and before some uh, years so we used to take a paper wise because at that time topic was not much available paper wise only used to take it up uh, we went through with a discussion over the phone call so whichever uh, is read by you theoretical preparation was alone now everybody theoretical preparation is different we don't know each other even though we are having a common resources but uh, preparation was not equal in the theory, theory wise so whatever he read whatever i read we used to mutually exchange while doing a pyq only are i identified this one you don't know how to do this you do this now i will explain this one when i get some new point i used to explain him so like that uh, the journey went uh, went with a total two friends only we three went uh, forward and after that uh, almost the paper two is going to end now what about the paper one blank paper one people and environment higher education all these are scary units for me what should i do so for that mainly paper one also what we identified we have to get the overview in the rl gupta uh, pyqs were there separately and one book one more book was there arihant where the theory used to give properly in that arihant even though pyqs were wrong or the questions were wrong theory they used to give properly that theory i used to read in uh, read, i used to read in the arihant book theory so theory wise i got a basic basic idea of each unit later solving a pyq is in the rl gupta again and again again and again but in this whole process we missed one point making a notes we didn't made any notes now if we look back after a march month or a april month uh, when once we look back examination is very near we didn't had prepared anything now not getting in the mind what we have done we have made some mistake note making except for a statistics lobo elaborative notes we made no other subjects we have prepared notes because uh, statistics was a challenging subject for me still uh, uh, you know 
that was a challenging subject and very new subject i used to scare about the numbers and i don't have a, that much confidence in the mathematics and all so what i've done uh, it is better to prepare only pyqs for those mathematical aspects but don't know why we have taken it as challenge because this vinay friend is uh, very good in statistics he used to uh, listen to many videos and preparing notes and all so we both together prepared that good notes together so once a pre notes preparation for the statistics done out of that out of that that only we used to repeat 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 every time when we revise only that notes we should not go to the more than uh, that uh, that much extent now uh, later pyqs as we missed out uh, note making na now pyqs from the pyq we started note making now theoretical note making is a very difficult time is not there so pyq note making how i need to make a note pyqs whenever we are doing it if unknown option or unknown concept is coming which we have not covered we used to go to the google and write it in a elaborate way when it is unknown when it is known that is in the process of doing a questions we identified some common questions like analogy question used to be there 2018 and before you you, you go and uh, look into it analogy question uh, that lr question square of position pakka question and syllogism pakka question if you draw the venn diagram these questions are damn sure it will give you the answer those static areas were identified with a trend while doing a pyq itself and even teaching aptitude evaluation system one question was common damn sure that is coming in every paper so like that common areas we identified and prepared that thoroughly and which is unknown concepts from the one paper to another paper which it is coming we need to write it in elaborate way if it is a known answer and known option only single line one line only this is how the notes have been prepared for the paper 1 and paper 2 for almost all the units or 10 10 notebooks used to be there small small chota chota notes will be there na or else if the one spiral bending notes is there in that right side this one left side one subject right side one subject like that this said both the sides two two subjects we used to write so like that almost a pyqs everything covered for the both papers almost a past 5 years 2012 to 2018 december was the target of pyq this years pyqs we prepared for the both papers and paper 1 while doing a pyqs data interpretation very less number of data interpretation solved but uh, whenever we solved we used to solve with a good uh, speed and all so daily practice of at least a one di why i will uh, i was uh, i am telling you now also i used to do that one di and one day basis rc i haven't prepared literally i am telling now i am telling to all rc you prepare it prepare it ic i didn't prepare rc i didn't prepared i went uh, to the exam for the rc directly now like this preparation uh, took it uh, to the last level in the last only i made a revision i didn't given mock test i didn't given anything at that time mock test was not available cbt exam was started just in the december 2019 and for the june 2019 no platform is providing a mock test and all even though they were providing we don't know about it and how to access to these are all things were there and later uh, i didn't given any mock test i revised only those notes which i prepared i revised only that statistics notes which i prepared i revised only the things which i have done in the last 3 uh, uh, to 4 months i didn't went through with a new sources so finally examination date released on the i, I believe june uh, 6th or something around or else june last month i didn't remember properly the examination date given afternoon exam my my shift was in afternoon so i went for it once i uh, uh, went for the exam na for the first itself rc appeared chalo anyway i mentally decided rc and di i need to do in the beginning only first i solved rc got a confidence because easy rc was there and later i went to the di uh, di was uh, uh, somehow good di which i solved the same type of di came in the exam so that mind was flying like anything mind is uh, you know it was flying like anything and uh, because by looking at the known question and known di and when the numbers i, I used to scare for the numbers now that is coming easily is this real question of a di and all or else i am doing wrongly and uh, getting easy answers so later chalo anyway i have done it 
um, once I have done with the D and RC, my confidence built up on the question paper. Chala, let us go for the other questions. MR questions I saw. Whatever the trend of the PYQ, same type of questions came in the MR. Lucky. In that aspect, I am lucky. I am lucky enough because to deal with the MR, I, as I told you, my weak point that is. So somehow I managed to uh, get the answer for those questions, but not all uh, questions became correct later. I will tell you about the result also. The question after answer key. So paper two, when I solved it, now paper two, when I started solving in the same way, however, the questions are coming, I solved it. However, the questions are coming, I solved it. Paper uh, two also moderate. I am feeling like somehow some questions when I look at it is feeling low, somehow uh, high when I'm uh, getting the uh, known questions. Like that, uh, entire paper completed once I came out and uh, I asked to these both friends, are how your exam, everybody is saying, are okay. If everything support, uh, we'll get qualified. Then we were waiting for the final key. Final key came. Final key came in the RC, I scored around a 4 by 5, I believe. 4 or 3, I didn't uh, remember. 4 or 3 only. RC, I made a mistake. But DI 5 by 5 was there. 5 by 5 in the DI was there. That uh, worked out very well. And in MR also not uh, good. 3, I think. 3 only. Remaining portion, whatever I given, uh, remaining portion, theoretical. So on and around total 33 questions I made it correct in the paper one as per the final uh, preliminary key. Later two questions got added. So preliminary key 32, 33 questions or 32 questions I made it correct. And in paper one around I believe I didn't remember the paper. Sorry in the paper two I don't know how many questions I made it correct. But altogether 214 was this score. 214 was the score altogether. That's what I can say. And uh, moreover, uh, the problem is that in uh, preliminary key, there were some mistakes. So we challenged that questions. Two questions were there. One is of income tax, that revenue and the capital wall. Still, I remember. And in paper one, some mistakes were there, but we are not that much expert to put a challenge for the paper one. So we left that. And in paper two, two, two questions we challenged that made it correct. So because of that question, uh, the number of questions increased, final uh, marks also increased by four marks. Instead of 210, it went to 214. That was a good mark at that time. Now, once it is done, now, once it is done, uh, examination completed, uh, final when the result came, uh, suddenly I was actually traveling in a bus, result is announced. I, I am going to Maharashtra on that day. Result is announced. And uh, my friend called. Uh, Are you qualified for the JRF? He didn't qualify. That was a sad part of it. Um, and he, he told me. Are you qualified for the JRF? I didn't believe. You sent me the screenshot. Then I believe. He sent me the screenshot. One brother used to be there. Who is Surinder uh, brother used to be there. He saw my result. And he. My friend also saw the result, but uh, Surinder brother sent me the screenshot first. Later done, done with it. Uh, I was feeling very happy and don't know to whom I am calling. First, I called to my mother and informed uh, this is how it happened. And uh, from the bus to, we need to reach to the railway station and uh, uh, from there the train journey. Train journey started. Uh, I have to inform to all, but there is no network surprisingly even i was i am i wanted to inform to many members but uh, there is no network at that time i called to two to three people and informed that bus so that was the total journey how i went through with the preparation in this total journey i will tell you i refer to the videos of manishika jain ma who is exam race she is very good uh, in the paper one so i used to watch her videos i should give a proper recognition to her even i try to inform her uh, at that time and uh, moreover the self notes as well as these two fellows diamond who is prep uh, who is uh, supported for discussing a pyqs as well as the guiding everything so friends how you utilize is more important over here how you utilize the friends uh, in your preparation journey rather than chit chat and all now whatsapp insta everything is there to distract so how you utilize the friends is also important. If you have this type of uh, a group who is having a common uh, type of targets, na, we should take a benefit out of it. We should take a benefit by interacting more and more, by discussing more and more. Because don't know how 
other person will explain the concept to you new concept will come into your mind and you will share the new concept with them it's a mutual exchange of knowledge as well as building up a rapport and finally arriving at a destination that's how it will go everybody will have a, a bad face like uh, what i got is that uh, improper resource there were no proper resources and uh, there were no you know proper uh, strategy to be followed like this only and there are no number of hours uh, that we used to put it how many hours we can able to concentrate that many hours only we used to study in the afternoon i used to sleep much in the night time and the morning time we used to study more and more so then i realized later rather than preparing for a competitive examination now i got a jrf i spent almost a one and a half years uh, of preparation on something which is uncertain which is the government exam that i i can say you must prepare for the exam but out of that uh, one year of uh, experience of competitive exam na that gave me a boost up. conceptually it made it very clear when I, when we are giving that competitive exam cipc was also another booster for us uh, to give the exam and to conceptually be clear on the paper 2 paper 2 was the main reason for getting my jrf i would say paper 1 i took it as a support only and uh, to increase the aggregate but paper 2 created a major role in getting the jrf and that is the main one where i can say uh, it led to jrf and after the jrf now uh, immediately within the 3 months i started teaching to the ugc net in my own youtube channel used to post small small videos like that nobody was watching also at that time i should say even still also very less people are watching i should admit that but still you know uh, i was entered into an academy once entered into an academy slowly 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 from the zero members in the class in fr- in the beginning first one month to now a good number of students in the class that's how the entire journey of the jrf went through what i can say to the all aspirants it is not about a motivational journey and all this is a simple preparation journey how you are having i was also having same type of journey many people will have and somewhere take you should take advantage of your beneficial areas you should work on your weak areas so i told you my weak areas were statistics and mathematics and data interpretation that's how i uh, by relying on the pyq solving i try to avoid that issue and statistics i prepared a detailed notes still some concepts uh, you know always confusing for the statistics so later uh, from the mindset of competitive examination or a government job mindset to settle down in the passion uh, with a passion into the teaching profession so now teaching is not a job for me it became a like you know even though it is a profession and money is a uh, one of the element which can motivate us but it is it became a passion slowly slowly it converted into a passion just don't want to leave this profession at any cost that is how the mind mindset got changed totally so that's about my journey guys uh, i feel that you didn't got bored out of this journey very small video that is 25 minutes around i, I think so please do watch this video and uh, do subscribe to my channel and do not forget to hit a like button and do subscribe to this channel join in my telegram group achievers at the aa the links are av- uh, already available in the um, description please go and join over there thank you so much